we'll make sure you're all in your groups here. So we're going to have... The idea of Young Scholars is really taking the ceiling off for kids and not making assumptions about children and really just giving them opportunities to show growth over time. Well, the Young Scholars model really is just trying to identify and serve our students who historically have been underrepresented in gifted education. It's important to think of it as a model and not a program because programs entail that this is a separate thing that's happening and extra, where we really want our teachers to understand that it is something that needs to be infused in their instruction every day. So the Young Scholars model is really looking at students that we know have incredible talents that need nurturing and perhaps more nurturing support from the schools and making sure that we are affirming the talents that they do have. So the idea of the Young Scholars model is really a mindset that every child learns better when they're given rigorous coursework. You know, when it's rigorous, you tend to be more interested. You actually have to do more of the work yourself. So our idea is that everyone will get that at our school. Find the definition or define. Our expectation is that they're using their brains and they're not as dependent on us. And when we go around, we're not giving them answers. We're actually facilitating and asking them the best questions so that they can think and then arrive at the answers. And see if that can help you. Remember, characteristics can be where you think the word comes from. What kind and then when you're doing that, if you're using resources written for gifted kids with all kids, you're taking the ceiling off for gifted kids you have in your classroom, for advanced learners, and providing opportunities for all. And that's something I love about APS specifically is that you're not getting pulled out for an hour in a week. You are getting that differentiation that you need through your teacher every single class with coaching from the resource teacher for the gifted. So that way you should have access to the proper challenge levels you need in every class. I'm very proud that we've moved to a coaching model for resource teachers because we're giving more teachers access to higher level curriculum, to critical and creative thinking, to enhance their instruction. So one of the advantages of coaching or doing a professional learning cycle with a teacher is that we can take those strategies and she learns them for our tier two, but then she uses them throughout the day with tier one. And we know our RTGs are one person for an entire school and they can't be everywhere at once. So the opportunity for them to coach the teachers and work with them then allows those teachers to do these amazing things with the students every single day. In our model, because we are screening the entire school population every single year, and because we don't have it dedicated as it is this classroom with this one teacher, we are able to identify more students, their specific talent areas, and nurture them. So as they move up from elementary to middle, we actually are having a new opportunity in middle school where we're gonna have open enrollment intensified courses added in ELA, science and social studies. Anybody can take these courses, they're no prerequisites. Because we want that to be available to our students who are identified gifted, we want that for our students who are identified as young scholars, but even all the students, so they have access to these really great resources. And then hopefully down the road, also identifying these students for gifted services and getting them into AP, honors, IB, any of those opportunities in high school as well. So it's really just about providing a lot of pathways or access levels for children because we know they need that opportunity in middle school and in elementary school, so they build their skills and their affirmation so they can be successful in high school and then eventually go on to college or trade school or whatever they want to do to be successful in life.